You can't have a dance competition without judges. We have some of the most world-class judges that you can possibly have. Judges, when you are called, please come forward. Our first judge has come all the way from Walhalla, South Carolina, a lifelong performer and teacher for over 30 years. Ms. Caroline Hoadley has been a member of the South Carolina Arts Commission's artist roster since 1993. She is a choreographer and master teacher in a variety of dance genre and is currently the director of a professional dance troupe which performs a Bavarian, Appalachian, clogging, Irish, and historical dances. Not only a Southern Arts Federation artist, Ms. Hoadley is a certified member of Dance Educators of America and author of Carolina Shag, The Spirit of Southern Social Dance. We welcome Ms. Caroline Hoadley. Next we have Professor Eric Nilsson of Valdosta State University who is serving as our Director of Judges. Professor Nilsson is the head of the Communication Arts Department and was the founding director of the VSU Repertory Dancers. Besides teaching on the college level for 32 years, Professor Nilsson is also a professional dancer choreographer and director. In 2003, he was honored with the Dance Educator of the Year Award from Georgia Association of Health, Physical Education, Recreation, and Dance. Let's give a warm welcome to Professor Nilsson. Our third judge has an international heritage as well as an international career. Dr. Caroline K. Picard of Gainesville, Florida, grew up in the Philippines of Filipino, French, Chinese, Spanish, and American ancestry. She has been competing and teaching ballroom dance since 1991 in England. South Korea and across the United States. In 2006, she won the U.S. Open Cabaret Pro-Am Theater Arts Cabaret Championship, where 40 countries participated. From 2002 to 2008, Dr. Picard di directed scripted and performed in an annual TV program for Florida State University's International Center, Ballroom and Beyond, which uses dance as a means of celebrating cultural diversity. Dr. Picard has singly authored or co-authored 14 published or forthcoming books, as well as numerous scholarly and popular articles. Some of her favorite topics include ballroom dance's quest to become an international Olympic sport and how ballroom dance is depicted in movies. Currently, Dr. Picard is a JD candidate at the University of Florida Levin College of Law. Let's give a warm welcome to Dr. Picard. Next, and our newest judge, is, Dr. is Mr. Henry Hernandez of Tallahassee, Florida. Mr. Hernandez is the founder and artistic director of World Ballet Incorporated. He has a long and successful career as a principal dancer who has danced worldwide and choreographed both classical and contemporary dance for major dance companies. While ballet is his primary dance form, he is well trained in every style of international folk dances as required by the, by the Vaganova training at the Teresa Carino Dance in Caracas, Venezuela. Mr. Hernandez is also trained in his own native folklore with dances Venezuela under the artistic direction of Yolanda Moreno. 
This institution continues today as the leading folk ballet company in Venezuela, winning prestigious international awards. Presently, Mr. Hernandez serves as consultant for the Shakespeare Summer Institute as, at Roland College. Let's welcome Mr. Henry Hernandez. And last, but certainly not least, Ms. Christia Kaufman from Valdosta, Georgia. Ms. Kaufman studied classical ballet performance at the University of Oklahoma and is experienced in numerous styles of dance. She has had formal training in classical ballet, jazz, tap, modern dance, contemporary, and clogging. Ms. Kaufman has also received instruction in belly dancing, lyrical and ballroom. She participated in the Kentucky Governor's School for the Arts program and has attended several professional dance master classes with the Alvin Ailey American Dance Theater, the Louisville Ballet, and the Dance Theater of Harlem. Let's give our judges a tremendous round of applause for their appearance here today. Thank you, judges. Before we begin, I would also like to go over our scoring system that the judges will be using. The first category that they look at is choreography, which is worth 20 points. They also have five categories worth 10 points each. They look for visual effect, projection, coordination, costumes, folk cult culture, music, and then 20 points for overall impression. Our awards this year, fifth place will be awarded $100, fourth place will be awarded $200, third place $300, second place $400, first place $500, and we've also added an award called the Most Distinguished Outstanding Award. To qualify for this award, a dance company or group that registers to compete for all three of the divisions, youth, adult small, and adult large, and wins first place in each of those divisions will be awarded an additional $500. So, we've upped the ante this year. Okay, let the competitions begin. Are we ready? Okay. 